Hello everyone, welcome back to the Keep Productive YouTube channel. On today's feature, we're diving into an application called Make Time, which is a fairly new application launched today, and it's actually from the creators behind the best-selling book, Make Time, John Zaratsky and Jake Knapp. Now, these chaps are behind the book of Sprint, which is a very popular book with designers and creatives. However, we're going to check out what the application does today in helping you to focus and keep on task. So what's cool is this application is already available on Android and iOS, and I believe it's free um, in terms of any in-app purchases, I believe. So that's really great news. So when you join up, if you haven't read the book, what's great is you get some information on the screen in terms of like how the concept works. Um, and as you can see here, you can follow through uh, the approach to your book. So obviously it's a four sort of tiered approach. You've got highlight, laser and reflect, and throughout that you energize. So the application, as I said, is broken into three parts, highlight, laser, and reflect. So for highlight, um, what's quite nice is you get a limited focus. They want you to focus on really just one thing at a time or just one main thing you want to do during your day. So in this case, uh, today's highlight for me, it could be um, edit or record. Uh, so as you can imagine, once you've set your highlight, you go ahead and you schedule it. So you can naturally bring it access to your calendar as well. So you can see I've got an appointment here and you can drag it onto your calendar. So what's brilliant is I can actually go ahead and set that highlight time and that has been saved and connected to my integrated calendar in this case it's Apple Calendar. So as you can see here, I've got the main focus of the day, but up in the top right hand corner, I can actually see uh, like the tactics in terms of why and how you are now embracing their methodology of highlighting one or two things to do during your day. What you can do from here as well is you can actually enter tomorrow's highlight. And as you can see, it suggests here that the highlight should be between 60 and 90 minutes long. Okay, so what happens, as you can see, is when you want to focus on your highlight, you do something, what the process is called lasering. So you laser focus on this. And as you can see here, there's a timer, very simple one. You can set it to whatever you wish. So in this case, it could be 30 minutes to do, 31 minutes. And it's already started the timer. So what's cool is if you go into settings as well, you can also avoid a sleep timer to keep your phone on while the timer is going, which is nice. So you can prop it up against your desk. Timer works very much the same and apparently it's presented by Time Timer. Again, up the top right, you can actually uh, look at some of the sort of integrations and tactics in terms of how it would benefit your productivity to avoid things like distraction. So as you can see here, what's quite nice is you can go to the reflect area and see sort of the tabs for the day, what you've actually done, uh, which is really nice. I really like this design in terms of having just like a post-it note. And as you can imagine, if you completed this, so it gives you sort of a review. So you click in and it says, did you make time for this highlight? In this case, I'd say yes. And as you can see, it's been done, sort of gives you a little bit of a celebration. And you can give it almost like a bit of an audit. So how well did you laser focus in on it? I'd say seven. It does a really nice sort of layout like, okay, I was, um, I seem to be getting better. You can sort of see an overview of it. So the methodology is really simple. Highlight, laser, reflect. Highlight, laser, reflect. And you sort of use it as a sort of way to hone in. I think the market is very um, going to be very popular in the future for these focus applications. It's something that I've definitely got on my uh, sort of back of my mind. Um, but this application is really well designed. Uh, as I said, um, it's free. And as you can imagine, I guess it's almost like a sub promotion of the book, but a neat way to start your productivity. So I definitely give this application a good rating especially because uh, it's free and easy to use and especially for those who are sort of looking to hone in on their focus. Before we go guys, I wanted to point you towards the Obsidian Made Simple course. We've recently launched it. It's still at that Black Friday deal, hopefully, if you get to it fast enough. Um, but as you can imagine, um, you can check that out in the link in the description. Thank you very much for tuning in today. If you're new here, please do hit subscribe. It'd be great to have you and I'll talk to you all very soon. Cheerio.